Now in this video, we're gonna be looking at how you can create a coloring page, okay? Now in order to find this uh, feature and this step, let's go to the dashboard. Now first, when you're in the dashboard, select Create Design and select the Designer Fast AI Image Designer. Now once you select the Fast AI Image Designer, we're gonna go to the second tab, AI Design Agents. Go ahead and select that now. Once you've selected that um, tab here, AI Design Agents, you will see step one has now appeared and there are a number of different tools you can choose from. Now for this specific um, tutorial, we're gonna be looking at coloring page. Okay, now go ahead and select coloring page. Once you select that, step two will now appear and this will give you the option now where you can configure your settings in terms of we're now going to put a prompt in this input section here, okay? And you'll see um, some text written here that the prompt must be suitable for coloring page and only for children. It's gotta be specific about what you want in your coloring page. The design will be black and white with bold outline. So, you know, you've gotta be very specific and it's gonna be children orientated only. And with coloring pages, you can just imagine as you create them, they are great where you can um, uh, essentially create your own books from them and use them as products that you can sell uh, where you know kids essentially can color in these um, coloring pages and then ultimately you could put them together as a book so it's a huge demand for it and a really good industry as well so here's an example right now example a happy cow with big round eyes on a farm so we can say a happy a happy duck next 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 to the pond okay and with this you can select a number of different dimensions you can choose from the size depending on uh you know the size of the creative or the page that you want to create okay and the beautiful thing about this is that you do well you can create 10 images a maximum of 10 images but you can create as many as you want by coming back to this feature itself so you can you know you could create huge amounts of um coloring pages using this feature okay so for this one let's just go and select five and generate coloring page now once you've done that it's going to redirect you to the personal design section where we're going to wait for process now in the meantime you can see some of the uh, another example that I created before where we've got um, a cow with big floppy ears standing um, standing on the farm okay or on a hill grass etc etc so this is a good demonstration how it will appear and it will look like so this is really good and once you have that ready we've got a couple of options we can first we can download that okay you can select download you can view um, the design that's been created Okay, so if any time you want to come back and you see the design and you want to recreate something and maybe improve upon it or maybe repurpose it and use it again, you can do so maybe using a different animal. So you can copy that and go back into the same feature under design agents and you'll see a different nice selection for you to choose from. But ultimately uh, for a coloring page, um, you know, if you put them all together into a major own book, it would be absolutely fantastic because you know they're going to be colored in, aren't they? So we'll give this a few minutes to process. Okay, and here we have our ducks. So we've got five different examples. You can see here we have a, a duck on the pond, and you can see an adorable duckling with big, curious eyes and fluffy feathers swims happily in the pond. So these are some really good designs that have come out and they're perfect for coloring um you know our coloring page or ultimately can create a coloring book using these examples uh, and it's got the nice bold outline so really easy uh, to use now furthermore what you can do with this once you are happy with your design you can obviously download it you can do a bulk download or you can move it into a respective folder if you create one Okay, so you could have all your designs in one project and keep everything nice and tidy. So you can see we can use different, if we're creating a, a coloring uh, book, we could create that book and we could have different animals uh, on each page ultimately, or each, you know, every five pages you could have um, cows, duck, 
tiger, giraffe, a monkey, etc., etc., and then you can download it and put together your book. Uh, alternatively, also, you do have the um, other function. This will be covered in another tutorial where you can create kids' storybooks, etc., etc. But for this one, we are looking at the coloring page, and when you go through the um, specifics of this tutorial, uh, you'll see it's really, really uh, easy to do, especially with the quantity, given you allowing uh, allowing you ten images to choose from. Now, if you wanted to a little bit more advanced, you can. Um, go to the edit this image and it will redirect you to the advanced image editor If for some reason you wanted to maybe take this a little bit further and you can see I could actually change the width So let's just say I put 920. Okay, I can make it a bit longer if I want and there would be nothing stopping you if you wanted to make something a little bit more um, orientated around maybe another type of media graphic and maybe you wanted to add a little bit of text okay you could do something like that maybe if you want to create your own kind of story as well manually and kind of uh, create another you know you could get more than one image here essentially let me show you what I mean so if you wanted to this is another way of doing it. I could just import this and here we have my duck here so if I wanted to I could just rearrange this and check this out I could put another duck there if I wanted to just like that okay and then if I wanted to I could put I could put this one just go to the layer just bring it back so when I bring that on the top there we go so happy ducks okay once I have that I could just go in here just extend it like so And you know you could give basic instructions especially for the age group say color in hair etc etc and that's it so this is just another feature where you could add different elements to it make it a little bit more snazzy add a little shapes a bit of color if you wanted to create a little bit more design uh, keeping in, in 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 theme with the coloring uh, coloring page aspect so this is just something on addition if you want to go a little bit advanced but however if you go revert back to the dashboard uh, the sole purpose for this tutorial was to show you how you can create a coloring page and ultimately creating those coloring pages uh, will give you the ability to create uh, books especially given the ability of creating uh, up to 10 image designs per uh, prompt generation Okay, so hopefully you've enjoyed this video on how you can create those coloring pages.